Thanks, Kate. Our team coverage continues with a look at what's happening on the ground. Way 31's Nicole Zedek joins us live from Colbert County. And while the th severe threat is over there, storm shelters are still open until the rain ends. So, Nicole, what are conditions like right now? Well, the storm passed through here pretty quickly. It's still raining behind me, but it's more of a drizzle compared to what was earlier. It was probably worse between 4 and 4.30. That's when the sky got very dark. There was heavy thunder, heavy rain, lightning. In fact, inside the storm shelter I was in, the walls were shaking from the thunder. But then around 4.45, the EMA director came and told me that so Colbert County was no longer under storm threat. And I was actually inside one of Colbert County's storm shelters all day. The emergency management agency spent yesterday preparing storm shelters. They were part of multiple briefings with the National Weather Service ahead of today's storms and made sure tornado sirens were up and running. But the EMA director said to stay alert on your phone as well and not just rely on warning sirens. Now, like we said, Colbert County is no longer under the risk for severe weather, but the county's 26 storm shelters will remain open until the system has passed. Reporting live in Tuscumbia, Nicole Zedek, Way 31 News.